Hello everyone, my name is Vladimir Enchev and in this video I'm going to show you how you can debug your Blazor application using Redzen Blazor Studio. So we have an application scaffolded from a database with three pages created for orders, order details and products with ability to add, delete and update records. We added security to our application we localized our application and we even use the query builder to sort the orders data descending by ID property on initial load. Now let's debug this orders call in our service to check what happens when you open the orders page. To start debugging, you can use the run menu but press debug. This will immediately start build of the application in debug mode. And when the application runs, the breakpoint will be enabled to stop when your orders page is opened. There is a debug pane on the left in Zen Blazor Studio where all the variables, call stack and the breakpoints can be observed. So here is our application and we are going to open the orders page. And as you can see, we hit our first breakpoint. Let's now use step into button to step into the service method get orders. As you can see, Erdzen Blazor Studio will open automatically the sample service where the get orders method is declared. So, as you can see, there is a query argument with everything populated and can be observed in the debugger. And you can do this as well in the variables on the left. You can also return to the previous call from the call stack. But let's continue to check uh, what happens when you execute a curable extension method for this DB set in our DB context. We are going to put here a second breakpoint and we will press continue. And the second breakpoint point just uh, uh, hit. And as you can see, our items are already populated. You can observe them. And here there is nothing in expand declare, so the query will just pass through the method and we will return the orders. Let's check our page and the orders are displayed. That's all for now. Thanks for watching.